Give it to me. Oh. <laughs> yeah. It's nice. Yeah, turn to the left. Mm. Tofu porn. doing his project mine was to get the sprinkler system up and running because last year we did not blow it out with the air hose so we did not save it and it got ruined therefore today I spent the day cleaning all of the long grass and making a new track for all of this beautifulness we zip tied it to there at an angle that it wouldn't kink at and I happened to find this three pieces of hose that just fit there. So we got this going to this grapevine. And then it goes all the way down. You can see all that. Alright, so there's my sprinkler. All the way down. And it ends here. Of the strawberry box. I put it underneath this piece of wood and here's the, extra, the piece so I can eventually tie something else to this and bring it across to the raspberries and right now Eric just finished this looks like it's dry he just finished his project which is calisthenics park. So there's our cement mixer we're using to put our really cement in the holes. If you ever, ever have to do cement, like do a bunch of posts for putting in a fence or anything, I highly recommend spending the $100 or whatever it is to trade on Craigslist to find one of those things. We put all of these fence posts in here all the way up the side and down the side in by hand mix that in buckets and in one of them little things on the ground. And it was not a good time. It was heavy and it was hard. That thing, beautiful. And it's, and it's electric. Just the two cubic foot. Probably like a Harbor Freight special or something. by fours here, screw it into the side to help level it up and down while it sets. Got our level that's been up there the whole time, and he's constantly checking these, and I'm like, that's enough. Put it up. You should show him your fence post. Good job. My fence post, one of these fence posts over here jets way up because I'm like, eh, close enough. Got his first bar up. First bar in, babe. Looking good. First bar in. So this is Eric's bar. He wanted it to be really high, so he had plenty of room to swing with his gigantic legs and length without hitting anything. Yeah. So you can touch our eight-foot ceiling, right? So that's definitely above eight feet that you're reaching there. And we might put like those climbing wall, we were saying those climbing wall pegs on the side, like for a leg up or something. There's going to be parallel bars on that side to get up in a set of stairs. Parallel bars there. And then my shorter bar is going to be over there between those two holes. It's going to be mine. We're going to trim that cherry tree up a little bit more. And maybe there's some, I think there's 
stuff I got might be a sealer for it. I need to stop the suckers from coming out after I cut a limb off. Because then all the little suckers come out and the little leaves. What were we calling it? End of the day accomplished minutes. You can't do nothing. Accomplished min minus. minus. Well, this is minus. Negative dollar. But actually, I mean, the thing is like six years old. So. We did get a, 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 you know what? How many bags of concrete did you put in? Ten. Ten total between the two. He wants to make sure that he can swing around with his weight and not make these, jack these posts up. And I was thinking between the two by fours we could put wood chips and stick a nice little pile of them. Put like some landscape cloth down and some wood chips just between them. Cut them to even lengths of course first. This one, when he was digging, he found the old septic field, it looks like. The old drain field. We don't have a drain field anymore or a need for it, but this is the low spot on the property, this flat area. And I think there was a pipe running kind of along here somewhere. Anywho, it's not being used anyway. I got some extra sand, it looks like, to put in the pool area, which I needed. So that's like, that's like three, five to eight bags of sand, babe. That's a pretty deep hole. That's probably deeper than my leg. Three feet is what it needs to be, roughly. That gives you 80 inches, which is your fully extent. Okay, well, there's our end of the day accomplished minutes. Awesome. Accomplished minutes out. Peace. Plants.